It was just pure instinct. I seen someone that needed help and wanted to help them. Nick Cox spends most of his week at his job, Queen City Harley Davidson in Fairfield. He's obsessed with the adrenaline a fast ride or run gives him. So he didn't hesitate to jump into action Thursday on his way to work. Driving through Middletown, he saw a red SUV going the wrong direction. Ed and I seen some lady to the left of me. She was screaming that there's a kid driving the car. Please somebody help me, please someone help. Went ahead and I threw my car in park and I just take off chasing after the car. Dash camera video shows seven-year-old Daniel Wittenbach behind the wheel, trying to control his parents' car. You can also see Cox get out and run after the car. He got to it quickly, asking the child to hit the brakes. And I seen he was going, going on to head on traffic, and it was just scary for everybody. The boy had found his parents' keys and took off in their Kia while they were asleep. I just kept trying to break the window, get the window open um, to try to get him out of the car. He could see the wide-eyed little boy the whole time. Yes, he looked very scared, very scared and confused. Um, he almost like he didn't know what was going on. What? He can't. Help. You're okay. You're okay. You okay, baby? After the little boy crashed into a Jeep, strangers made sure he was taken care of until first responders showed up. I'm, I'm glad the people that stepped up and did, did. Daniel is doing okay. He was taken to the hospital just to be checked out, but is doing fine. Police say charges are not expected in this, but the Butler County Children's Services is investigating the incident. In Middletown, Jatera McGee, WNWT News 5.